We're doing a countdown. This is, uh, you're down to day four of being 16. You're going to be 17 on Tuesday. Yeah. What are you planning on doing to celebrate your 17th birthday? Uh, nothing too big. Just, um, just going to be uh, taking it easy. Uh, I only have like four days, so I'm just going to relax because I, I start my world tour starting on the 4th. So um, just going to mentally prepare and just relax. Hopefully um, see my grandparents will be out here and um, I'll be able to spend time a little bit with them. And the, My grandma makes the best cheesecake. Oh, really? Cheesecake, so. Is that your favorite? Yeah, she made that for me for my 13th birthday. Yeah. She made me cherry so cheesecake. So you remember it well. Yeah. Justin, but. your fans were shocked as we all felt the uh, reverberations of the haircut heard around the world. Yeah. Two days, you cut it. Two days ago. Um, how come? Um, I don't know. I just wanted to. That's all. Pure and simple. You just sure, wanted to change just, it up. Yeah, nothing. No, not really a big reason. Just saying, I'm just woke up and I was like, I don't want this anymore. So I just cut it, and it's not. I mean, it's not really about that. I think you know the fans really liked it, but I mean, they'll they'll like me no matter what because it's you know I think it's it's about the music and and uh, so I'm really excited to see what what the fans overseas think and um, and take it by yeah. day by day. Well, now, here you are already coming out with a new version of Never Say Never. It's Never mm -hmm. Say Never 2.0. Yeah, so it's not like a, it's going to be available on, on the weekend. Uh, yeah. So I'm really excited. It's 40 minutes of extra footage. Um, so it's basically kind of like a new movie. Um, and it's it's really exciting because it, it shows like me and my, my friends more and, and uh, shows different part of the concert. So it's going to be great. And... Uh, hopefully all the fans go back and watch it. You know, my movie shows that anything is possible and dreams do come true. So that's kind of different seeds, we, you know, I want to plant in people's lives to just be like, anything is possible. And if you, you know, if you put God first and remember to always stay humble and always be gracious, then, you know, anything can happen.